We heard on the news earlier on a teacher who won the lotto and ditched it all in pursuit of a career as a crime writer. Um, I mean, is that ever? Is there ever a bit of you that's like, geez, I'd love to ditch this, you know, nine to five doctor thing? <laughs> well, first of all, it's not nine to no, five. No, I bet it's, it's like, not. It's like 14 hours a day. But I don't want to ditch it. I definitely don't because I love, I love where I work and I love my patients. I've been there for... 12 years at that same surgery so I know I feel like I've got to that point where I can say to some of the kids I remember when you were just a little dot in your mum's belly and then you get in trouble because they don't know how they got there (laughs) but but no I don't think I would ever ditch it I love the writing I love the telly stuff and I think I've got a balance well probably yeah I think I've got I've got no life (laughs) I do all this work don't worry about that yeah loads of time yeah yeah, exactly (laughs) but I I quite like how it's working at the moment I don't think but no no shade on that teacher teaching is hard man totally hard so I get it and do um how do the patients respond are they ever like don't be using me now as a case study on Lorraine (laughs) next week no normally they come in because I've been there for so long they don't care that I'm on TV because that's a relatively new thing okay and and so they they usually start every tea uh uh um, appointment with just a roll of their eyes and going oh you're on the TV again that's why it's so hard to get an appointment even though I'm there like at crack of dawn <laughs> so if your mum is not keeping you grounded they are yeah my mum calls me at work and like I, she's only supposed to call me in emergencies but it's stuff always stuff like oh um, I need a new what do you think of these curtain patterns <laughs> <laughs> Vital stuff. Vital stuff. Very time sensitive. (laughs) She rang one of the receptionists to find out if I wore a coat to work during the winter. (laughs) She really did. (laughs) And she brings them in food as well to get them on side. (laughs) To get them on side. So she'll always have her calls put through. Always. Always. She's got like the the staff number. She's a genius. (laughs) An evil genius. Yes. I love that. 